सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू वी आई एच ग्रुप यूट्यूब चैनल टूडे द वीडियो टॉपिक इज़ वेरी मच इंटरेस्टिंग इट इज़ ए पी टी ट्वेंटी सेवन विच इज़ यूजली कॉल्ड एज चाइनीज लिंक ए पी टी ग्रुप सो येस वी विल बी हैविंग टूडे अ डीप एनालिसिस ऑन दिस स्पेसिफिक ए पी टी ग्रुप एंड एट फर्स्ट कंटेंट क्रेडिट गोज टू साइबर एंड लेट स्टार्ट दिस वीडियो सो these are the couple of things that we are going to cover today first thing we'll be having a small introduction about what is apt27 then we'll get to know the attack method that are being used by them then the malware that they are using the vulnerability that they are exploiting then we'll move to the attack history that they have performed in recent year years then little bit about what kind of tar- organization they are targeting and that after then we'll get into the mitigations of 20 apt27 how they are attacking and how we can mitigate their attacks and at last we'll be discussing on ioc which is called indicators of compromise and then we'll conclude this talk so i hope you are going to enjoy if yes just click on thumbs up button and you can comment your views as well so at at first the introduction to apt group so the origin was 2009 in 2009 apt group was apt27 was started so apt27 is uh, usually called chinese threat group also known for extensively using water holing technique and spear phishing attacks to target victims the threat group which has been active for over a decade uses multiple malware and exploit numerous vulnerability to meet its espionage goal so it keep altering the attack strategy and ploys the avoid detection while spying on victims lately the group seems to have started working on a new model of espionage and along with financially motivated at- attack by including ransomware in their attack campaign so this was the small history about uh, um, the small thing about what is apt27 and how they get famous for all those thing now let's uh, know little bit the name related to apt27 so these are a couple of names which is being associated with apt27 so whenever you see any of this name it means ap apt27 name is there so the first name is apt27 for sure imc panda is the same name of apt27 iron tiger jip token group 35 tamp.hippo tg3390 iron panda Uh, lucky mouse lucky mouse without a space iron panda threat group 3390 and bronze union these are the also the name of uh, this specific apt27 group so these are the att- attack motives why they are doing attacks first thing is for the cyber cyber espionage campaigns second thing they are usually attacking for data theft and at last uh, third point is basically ransom they are doing some sort of ransom attack to just get ransom from that uh, victims now let's understand little bit about their attack methods so apt27 is right now capable of deploying a variety of tools and technique for its cyber espionage mission between 2015 and 17 the threat group compromised victims network by using water holing te- technique uh, via nearly 100 compromised legitimate website So, despite public disclosure of its activity in 2017, the gang cyber espionage operation continued with evolution in its mission. In February 2019, the group attempted living of the land attack to steal information on cutting-edge weapon technology and spy on dissident and other civilian groups. Later on, in uh, 2020, I guess in uh, March, the APT group abuses the COVID-19 pandemic fear to lure people by sending a uh, thetic email campaign or tempting im or phishing malware links and later on on to april 2020 it has carried out cross platform attack on back end servers to steal business data so these are the couple of attack method that are being used by the apt27 they are famous for water holing attack spear phishing remote code execution leaving of the land attack rootkit attack supply chain attack and unauthorized access So these are a couple of attacks that are being involved in APT twenty seven hacking campaign. If you want detail video on any of these, then just comment it down. We'll just create on it as well. Now uh, the malware that are being used 
and the vulnerability that was exploited by the team. So in uh, starting in uh, 2011, a honeypot computer discovered the exploitation of vulnerability in Microsoft product in which AP27 dropped ghost rat which is uh, basically pronounced as GS, GH, 0 ST rat. Later on in 2013, the group uh, was discovered using various plug X malware strain. The same year, the group de also deployed a web cell, which is known, known as China Chopper. And during the attack on SharePoint servers belonging to the Middle East government, in 2016, a malware variant of HTTP browser was discovered, which, uh, which researcher linked to APT27 group. Basically, the working and uh, modus operandi was almost same. That's why the researchers just concluded that this is uh, linked to the, to the APT27 group. And basically, it was targeted a consumer's drone company in Europe as well. Later on, on, on uh, 2018, in February, the group had launched an attack campaign named PZCHAO, PZCHAO, and using two versions of um, Mimikaz password scrapping utility to collect password and upload them to the C2 server. The threat actors also tried it uh, their hands to crypto mining attacks using zombie by malware which abused uh, multiple vulnerability in compromises targeted network which is uh, something like CV 2017-9073, CV 2017-0143, CV 2017-0146 so these were the couple of vulnerability that they just took benefit of it and after that in uh, 2018 in September 2018, multiple infections from a previously unknown Trojan were discovered in the attack and that used a malicious NDIS proxy drive. And you can say the NDIS proxy driver with a certificate of Chinese IT company. So it was also given a intruder of this is linked from the Chinese and might be APT27. Later on in 2020, the APT27 used an updated version of Jedex cell rat to target the latest version of Windows 10. Basically, that in that year, Windows 10 was launched, I guess. So they were trying to uh, use the latest version of Jedex cell rat, and uh, which is usually used to target the latest version of Windows 10 because it, the signature was not uploaded onto their Windows Defender. So it was not easy to catch that specific rat. So that's why it was in a wild use. Later on, in 2021, the attackers deploy climbing and plug X using an older Google update executable that was exposed to DLL side loading. And additionally, they view CV 2017 and 0213 to escalate privilege, means something privilege escalation kind of thing where they are getting the kind of administrator access. So it was found, and in that specific uh, attacks and year, it was found that. Utilizing other tools that include PSPX, Spy Web Cell, Post Exploitation Tool, Bits Admin, Hypo Bro Backdoor, and uh, there are some Bit Locker, Mimiscat, and uh, uh, Crypto Miner. And later on in 2021, in March, the group exploited several vulnerability, which was CV2021 26 8582627065 and 26855 which was a proxy legion vulnerability which was affecting microsoft exchange server and in the same year means last year 2021 in april the group updated its toolkit with an updated sys update malware variant and in september researchers alleged that apt27 was behind an attack campaign exploited a vulnerability cb2021 40539 in Joho's managed engine product and DS self service plus. So I hope you all heard about Joho. There was an attack on Joho okay, in recent years. So it was APG 27 who was behind that specific attack. So later on, however, a similar attack that abuses a newly identified vulnerability 2020, CB 2021 44077 in Joho managed engine and service desk plus was dedicated to the Chinese group. And uh, in this year, in 2021, security expert discovered APT27 relying again on hyperbrew rat 
to backdoor target in Germany and meanwhile fileless and socketless backdoor malware dubbed socket detour was used against US defense contractor in February where researchers suspected to link to APT27 group. So in our daily hacking news series that we are covering at midnight on our the same YouTube channel VIH group, we are covering all this thing. There was an attack on Joho, we have also covered. There was an attack on the contract defense contractor of US, it was also covered. So you can get update from April 27 from there as well. So this was, as I told you, there were a couple of malware that was used in, um, by this specific uh, hacking group, APT group, APT27. First one is Sogu, Ghost, PSPX, Spy, Direct Cell Rat, Hyperbro, Plug X Rat, Window Credential Editor, and Found Core. So this was the, basically the things that was being used from this specific uh, group as a form of malware. Now let's understand the tool that was used in this specific attack. So most probably you all are going to learn about this. You, you can search on GitHub, you can search on Google, you'll get a lot of information. So this was the tool that was being, that was as well that are being used right now by the APT27 group. First one is the China Chopper. Second is the JetStack Dump. Third one, HTTP Browser, Impacket, IP Config, Mimikatz, NVT Scan, Net, OVA Auth, PW Dump, JetXL. So these are the couple of tools that was being used from the side of APT27 for performing the attacks. Now the attack history. So APT27 first sought into the limelight of September 2015 when it installed trillion of bytes of confidential data from US government and its military defense as military defense uh, contractor intelligence agency and FBI based partner as well. So there was a huge attack on US infrastructure which was associated with the US government. Later on the next month a variant of core plug rat which is called plug x that I told you earlier was found this key use and antivirus to target Vietnam's Institute of Doxing where 4 lakh members of Vietnam's airline this is the uh, Vietnam's airline uh, flight where 4 lakh members of Vietnam airlines were doxed and the group carried out an espionage campaign in June as well in 2018 when it discreted plant malware in Mongolian government this is kind of Mongolian government so uh, they were attacked uh, they were put up some sort of malware onto the Mongolian government website later on the uh, researchers disclosed Syrian user as government next target and group next target it was it was said that uh, Syria will be the next target of this specific group in the following month and it uses window and android spyware to exfiltrate sensitive information from this on their de devices later on the group forward into financially motivated cyber crime scene in 2021 and onwards they started using ransomware in the attack and it, it reportedly infected the servers of several major gaming companies globally they launched attack on the vietnam's government and military organization in an advanced campaign where researchers revealed this specific thing in, in april 2021 the next month, the threat group installed a web cell on SharePoint server to compromise government organization. And later in December, a chat software able to on, uh, chat software uh, which was uh, a kind of uh, desktop software used by the 430 government agency in Mongolia was abused to spread the hyperbro backdoor. And uh, core plug rat and uh, TM manager it was spreaded at the time of Mongolian government. During its attack on the Joho platform uh, that I told you earlier, the APT27 impacted at least nine organizations across multiple critical sectors worldwide, including defense, energy, healthcare, and technology. And in this year, uh, right now in 2022, in January itself, German Domestic Intelligence Service, this is a sign of the German uh, Domestic Intelligence Service, so they were warned against ongoing attack which was coordinated by APT27. The group is also su suspected to be a part of larger tile temple campaign wherein the network of at least one US defense contractor were compromised. 
So this was a couple of attacks that were performed by the HPT27 group in the recent year and this was the history of that specific group. So these are the couple of sectors that was being targeted by APG27. First one the government, they are targeting usually government, IT research, business services, high tech, energy department, aerospace department, travel, automotive and electronics department. Always this was the some sort of target that was always uh, being entertained by this specific group. So couple of targeted entities the group, um, matlab, let me define you all this thing. The group has targeted multiple regions across the world, part of the world, including America, Asia, the Middle East and Europe. As a target sector, it always appears interesting to government, information technology, research, business services, high tech energy, aerospace, travel, automobiles and electronics. Some of the notable target entities include Ampere SA, Microsoft, Evil Desktop, Mongolian government agency, Turkish agency and German commercial organization. So these were the couple of uh, organizations that were being targeted in the previous days. And uh, reason, as I told you, North America, South East Asia, Western Asia, Eastern Asia, Southern America and Middle East. This was usually on the target range of APT27. Now let's talk about the mitigations how we can mitigate these attacks from APT27. So the use of email as an attack vector by APT27 is very common and looking at the seriousness of this threat, organizations are suggested to train their employees regularly. Uh, as for the protection against the web cell, employees regularly update application and operating system to fix any known vulnerabilities. To limit misuse of unauthorized access, implement at least privileged policy on the web server to reduce the ability of attackers to escalate privilege or pivot laterally. And as we all know, APT27 also conduct ransomware attacks, so it is recommended to keep your frequent backup of sensitive information and apply robust anti-ransomware solution for better protection. Moreover, the best way to counter that keep on continuously evolving its attack vectors is by operationalizing threat intelligence across security workflow use advanced threat, threat intelligence platform as well this will be going to help you as well try to implement SIEM uh, SOC security operation center in your organization in your institute wherever you are working either if you are working in government as well then this is most preferable apart from this if there will be any cyber attack on any of the organization and if you are associated with India if you are in India then you can report to cybercrime.gov.in. The law enforcement agency will always try to help you in their best. And at last, if you're not getting any solution, then you can contact us as well. We'll try to help you out in that specific situation. Now, uh, these are the couple of uh, indicators of compromise. The campaign against uh, this uh, specific PPT page is related to campaign, which was against server desk, desk plus. So these were the files that was being found. Uh, this was the SHA 256 encryption that was found and this was the path where the things were being saved and from where this was executed. This is the IOC for cyber attack on exchange server domain. These are the domain that was being targeted, the IP that you can look out in the um, Google as well. DLL files and these are a couple of ITs which was found on specific uh, attack and this is the indicator of compromise which is of Mongolian government. So these were the URL that was associated, IP address, domain and these are the file names which was saved into the system. So the confusion part at last. So as we all know APT27 seems to be active at present and has already shown advanced capabilities in targeted victims using different malware and methods. So further, the group take advantage of every possible vector to get access inside targeted organization. It keep on continuously updating its tool, tactics and procedure which is called TTP. They were usually do, doing all these things to stay ahead in the game. And researchers suspected that the group will continue its attack and come up with more enhanced tactics in the near future. So thus, the organization should stay alert and proactively track this threat group to ward off any 
forthcoming damage to the businesses so these were a the couple of things that we have covered in this specific video so if you need any help if you want anything from our side anything any help whatever you want so these are the contact uh, details of ours vih group and you can look out on social medias uh, on every twitter instagram facebook and uh, linkedin you can reach out us with the name vih group you can mail us support at vih.com and this is a website where you can visit so by that being said thank you for watching this video i hope you got a lo lot of things to learn if yes you can click the subscribe button and you can share with your friends so thank you very much for watching this video have a great day jai hind